Oh boy, do I have a good one for you guys today. This is day five of building the ultimate mobile service van. In this video, I'm showing you guys the most difficult part so far of working on the van, which was replacing the intake manifold. This vehicle is 10 years old, and with that being said, in order to access the passenger side spark plugs, I had to remove the intake manifold. And that was not fun. One of the previous videos, I showed you guys that I changed these spark plugs, but I did not include that I had to hassle for days removing the intake manifold as you can see in the clips i just had bolts break on me i had to re-thread them i actually had to cut some of the bolts blindly keep in mind it was just a hassle these clips are very short just showing you basically what i've done in order to maintain it i guess and repair it all right that's enough complaining in the clips that were just shown i actually made an attachment onto my milwaukee vacuum in order to vacuum out the intake ports here where the valves are just because while the engine was open for a couple days while i was waiting on parts you never really know what crud gets in there were actually kits available with new o-rings for the fuel injectors so i made sure to replace those new clips as well fuel rail goes right on top of it and while i was here i removed the engine coolant thermostat just to make sure uh it was you know it's a cheap part, so I thought might as well toss it in. Now I made sure everything was in place, bolted on, coolant hose was in place. By the way, any O-ring that I have replaced, I've made sure to put some silicone lubricant on it just to make sure that it doesn't break while installing these components. It was simple as installing all the sensors, coolant hoses, wires back in place. I didn't actually show it in this video, but I made sure to also clean the throttle body and replace the engine intake filter. That's pretty much it for this one. There's still plenty of work to be done on the band, and I'll see you guys in the next one.